In the last video, you guys asked me to make a step-by-step -step installation video of Android 11 for Poco F1. Well, here we go, and sorry for the late upload. This is Awaken OS based on Android 11 running on Poco F1. Hey, what's up guys, KSK here. Welcome back to this new video. In this video, I will show you how to install official Android 11 on Poco F1. This is a step-by-step -step detailed installation guide. For those who are willing to get the official taste of Android 11 on your Poco F1, make sure you watch the video until the end without missing any parts of the video. Let's get started. Awaken OS is a custom ROM that is based on Android 11 that brings a pure stock Android experience that you would get on Poco F1. This update seems to be a pretty good compared to another Android 11 ROMs out there. Now keep in mind, this ROM is not a super stable, but still it does the job for daily usage. Now without a further ado, let's get into it. The only prerequisites for this video, you need a Windows PC and your device should be having an unlocked bootloader. That being said, I'm moving on to step number one, backing up all important data. Now please be make sure to install Android 11 custom ROM on your POCO F1. You must be running a MIUI 12 stable update on your POCO F1. If in case you haven't installed MIUI 12 update, I'll leave a link in the description box down below. Go ahead, download and flash it via TWRP. Now on your POCO F1 running MIUI 12, make sure to back up all of the important data like pictures, videos, documents and everything to the PC or laptop. This process requires a clean installation and you have to format the internal storage. Once everything is done, sign out from me account, Google account as well as remove all of the lock screen passwords, fingerprints, patterns to make this installation hassle free. Step number two, downloading required files. Now it's time to download all the asset files. The first link will take you to this page where you need to download the TWRP image file. The second link will land you to this page to download the disabled force encrypted zip file. And the third link lets you download the main ROM which is Awaken OS, download the latest version. I recommend downloading the ROM which is bundled with Google applications. And the last link lets you download the platform tools which contains ADB and fastboot drivers. Once it's done downloading all of the files, place it somewhere on your desktop for easier navigation. Now go ahead extract the platform tools using a WinDRAW extractor. Once it's done extracting, move the TWRP image file into the extracted folder where you may find ADB and fastboot drivers. Step number three, installing TWRP custom recovery. Switching back to the camera view, now go ahead, connect your POCO F1 to the computer and copy the disabled force encryptor file to the internal storage. Once it's copied, it's time to boot the device into fast boot mode. To do so, hold down the power key and then choose reboot option. While it's rebooting, keep holding the power down button to boot into a fast boot mode. Now on your Windows computer, within the extracted folder where you have copied the TWRP image file, highlight the address bar and type CMD. This will launch a command prompt from the current working directory. 
Inside the command prompt, type fastboot devices and press the return key. This will return with a string of text that means your device is properly responding to the fastboot commands. Now it's time to flash the custom recovery. To do so, type fastboot flash recovery twrp and press the tab key to autocomplete then press the return key to finish it. Once it's done, type fastboot boot twrp and again press the tab key to autocomplete then press the return key to boot into twrp recovery. Now at this point your device should boot into twrp recovery. Inside the TWRP custom recovery, choose the install zip option and select the internal storage and look for the file called disable force encryptor and flash it. Once it's done flashing, choose wipe, select format internal storage and type yes. Make sure you have backed up all the information safely. This stuff will wipe everything inside your device. Once it's done, choose reboot and boot back to TWRP. Once it's rebooted back to TWRP, now go ahead and connect your device back to the computer and copy the Awaken OS ROM file to the internal storage. Once it's done copying, detach the USB cable. Now choose wipe select system data and cache and swipe these three partitions now select mount option and mount system and vendor partitions now keep in mind if you're coming from the latest miui 12 the vendor on firmware for android 11 is already included within the system and you don't need to flash any other zip files. That being said, choose install zip option and look for the ROM file and flash it. Please be patient, the flashing process may take a little bit of a time. Sit back and relax. Once it's done, reboot your device, and that's it. This is how you install Android 11 on your POCO F1. Let me know what you think about it. If you have any doubts or suggestions, write down in the comment section down below. That's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching this video. This has been KSK Ryle. I'll catch you in my next one. Peace.